What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Wave Man Mike, and we're back for another video. Stay tuned. All right, in today's video, we're gonna be talking about dry hair. It seems like a lot of people have been asking about this recently. A lot of people have been asking about dry hair. Can I make a video on dry hair, how to keep your videos, I mean, how to keep your video how to keep your hair from being dry so that's what I'm gonna do in this video all right so how do you keep your hair from being dry we're gonna be talking about that in a second but first I need to give a shameless plug to the clout goggles you can go check them out on Instagram they sell lots of dope sunglasses go look them up go buy some because they're nice this is another pair that I got you like these I, I think I like these. I mean, these are my favorite because they're like very reflective and everything. But go check out these too. These are called the offset glasses, I believe. I believe these are called the offset glasses. Look at them. Nice. But yeah, let's get back into the video. Well, no, actually, I got something I need you to do. You already know what it is. Go press that like button. Go comment. Go in the comment section and comment. Go in the comment section and comment clout because these are the clout goggles what else would you comment but anyway i'm gonna go ahead and take these off so you can get a good look at my eyes see how serious this is so let's get into the video all right so how do you keep your hair from being dry well first let's think of what dry is dry is the opposite of something being moisturized you probably already knew that but it's very confusing i just learned this like when I was trying to learn about like skincare and everything like that, like I haven't kept up with my skincare in a few months, but yeah. So there's, okay, there's a difference between something being moisturized and something being hydrated. Just because something's hydrated doesn't mean it's moisturized. Just because something's moisturized doesn't mean it's hydrated. The opposite of something being hydrated is something being dehydrated. The opposite of something being moisturized is something being dry. So in this video, we're gonna be talking about something that's dry and that thing that's dry is your hair so what exactly do you do to moisturize your hair well one way that you can start is to put moisturizer in it no no no. scratch that before you even do that make sure your hair is clean so go ahead and wash your hair if your hair is not clean how is the moisturizer really going to do its job how is it going to get down to your hair and do what it needs to do if it's dirt in the way you're pretty much just moisturizing the dirt that's on your hair wow that just made a lot of sense so what do you need to do you need to go wash your hair and then put some moisturizer in your hair why so you can moisturize it you hear that moisturize moisturize your hair with moisturizer oh makes sense right yeah i know so go get some moisturizer put in your hair because that is what it's doing it's moisturizing your hair well i know that i said that moisturizing and hydrating aren't the same thing but i mean when it comes to hair you probably want to have your hair nice and hydrated what do you think you need to do to hydrate your hair sit and think about it i'll give you about 10 seconds I, lost, I wasn't even counting. I'm not even gonna. Yeah. To hydrate your hair, you need to drink water. Drink a lot of water. I didn't just say drink. I'm not talking about juice. I'm not choc ugh, chocolate, really. I just came from Hershey Park, so I keep saying chocolate. I'm not talking about juice. I'm not talking about soda. I'm not talking about any of the stuff that you can drink other than water. Because believe it or not, uh, what's it called? Uh, Oh yeah, yeah. Juices and stuff like that are actually dehydrating you because they have sugar in them. So don't drink all this sugary stuff. Just drink water. Just plain old water. Okay, going back to what I was talking about, about washing your hair. Why do you need to put moisturizer in your hair if you're already washing it? Hello, duh, water. You're putting water in your hair, duh. Boy, if you don't get- Well, it's actually the opposite of what you think or what you might be thinking. For all I know, you could just know what I'm talking about. Water actually, not when you're drinking it, obviously, but when you're putting it on something like your hair or your skin, it's actually drying it out. It's actually sucking all of the moisture 
out of whatever you put it on. That's why you need a moisturizer to put that moisture back in that the water just stripped it out. That's one of the reasons why you don't wash your hair every day because you're gonna be stripping the moisture instead of putting more in. So I say wash your hair maybe once, no, what am I talking about? Yeah, yeah, once or twice every week. No more than that. Maybe two to three times. Any, okay, anywhere between one to three times a week. No more than that. If you're doing it five, six, seven times a week, nah, no boy, no. 21. Same thing with put, putting too much moisturizer in your hair. You don't wanna be doing that every day. One, because that stuff's expensive and you don't wanna be wasting it all. And two, because, I mean, just think about it. Too much moisture, like think about it. Too much water in your body, you can die from drinking too much water. What do you think it's gonna do to your hair? You don't wanna drown your scalp, so don't overdo it. And just think about it, if you're doing it too much, it's probably gonna be all, <clears throat> ah. If you're doing it too much, it's probably gonna be all cakey and it's gonna start building up, like, no. So I recommend doing it two to three times a week. But when should you do it? This is the big one because I get so many people talking about, I put moisturizer in my hair and then I put my durag on, I go to sleep, I wake up and then my hair's dry. Why do you think that is? Why do you think your hair's dry when you wake up? Probably because the durag is absorbing that moisture that you put in. So instead of putting your moisturizer in at night and then wearing your do-rag and have that just absorb all the moisturizer, why don't you put the moisturizer in in the morning? And then if your hair like starts over curling, just put your do-rag on for a couple of minutes, maybe 15 to 30 minutes just to lay it back down after you brush, of course. And then put your do-rag, you know, back on and then take it off. So maybe it might still absorb some of that moisturizer into the do-rag but nowhere near as much as if it was all night and your hair's just completely just dry. But yeah, I don't really have much else to talk about in this video. I was just trying to teach you guys how to keep your hair from being dry and apparently how to keep your hair from being dehydrated as well. I hope you learned something in this video because I definitely taught something. If you did learn anything, that's fine. I know what you can do. The easiest way to learn, just watch the video all over again. It's a cycle. Even if you did learn something, you can still watch the video over again. You can watch this video, you know, today. You can watch it tomorrow. You can watch it next week, next month, next year. It doesn't matter as long as you watch it and you learn what I'm talking about. Also, recommend this video to other people because I know you know some people with dry hair. And drop a comment down below. You already know what I said to comment. I said the comment clout, like the clout, ugh, like the clout goggles. <laughs> If you didn't like the, I shouldn't even have to tell you to like the video. If you didn't like the video by now, I don't know what you're doing. I don't know who you think you are, but go press the like button. It's not that hard. It's pretty simple. It's pretty easy. So go press the like button. Let's try to get 400,000 likes on this video. That won't happen, but we can still strive for it. We stay striving over here. We're gonna strive until we get to the top. So let's shoot for 400 thousand likes on this video anyway i'm wave man mike subscribe comment and like enjoy your day you too what's up it's your boy wave man mike and we're back for another video stay tuned you too what's up it's your boy wave man mike and we're back for another video stay tuned